Oh, how to put it into words. Once, in a gay bar so dreary, while I guzzled, buzzed, and bleary, eyeing queer and queasy faces I'd seen so many times before, while I nodded, nearly napping. Suddenly there came a tapping, sound of ice cubes quickly cracking, a news drink I wasn't sure. A man had sat down next to me, I smelled the cheap perfume he wore, no doubt a troll, nothing more. I remember that day in August when I turned my head in disgust and first looked upon this creature, so tall, so blonde, so muscular. By his tight t-shirt, spandex shorts, I knew he liked lifting, I knew he liked sports. I imagined sins of all sorts, at last, a love like none before. Mr. Perfect, he would heal me, and my soul, he would restore. Had to have him, I was sure. We drove home in my Camaro. I put on Ravel's Bolero then nearly sucked his nose off while carried to the second floor. That night we got some little rest, our stamina put to the test. Neighbors screamed, who the hell's your guest? A little quiet, they implored. He liked my house, so I said, stay here. I'll pay you the room and board. I admit it, I'm a whore. The first week was just pure heaven. We had sex from noon to seven. He didn't mind if I bought presents or even that I tend to snore. To worship his body I desired, but of his mind I soon got tired. Then I found he had conspired to send my checkbook through the floor. Dinner was ten eggs, a turkey, five protein shakes, and beer galore. Pity my refrigerator. As our bickering took its course, his horrid habits got even worse. I hate it when he takes a dump and doesn't close the bathroom door. I said, get out, you make me mad. But he won't go back to mom and dad. He sits there so sexy and sad muscles tearing my clothes he wore. The only guys who like him are my grocer and my tailor. He's gotta die, that's for sure. A month I plotted and planned it, that perfect chest I just can't stand. I want to see it smothered in steaming, dripping, bloody gore. Now maybe you think I'm crazy, but he's so dumb, crass, and lazy. Tomorrow he'll be pushing up a daisy, my life just like it was before. I'll be back inside the bar, and in a drink my soul outpour. Lonely again, for evermore? tempered our love just might progress some more. Is it worse to be alone or atop a bodybuilder? Please don't leave me, Theodore. <laughs> <laughs> 